Can you do me a huge favor? Yeah. If me or somebody else is lifting weights over here, just try to make sure you stand like maybe 10, 15 feet away. Cause I don't think I'm gonna drop that. But if I do and I fall over, I don't wanna fall over on top of you, okay? What? I'm just I'm just Might have been 11 reps. What's up guys? Tyler is here with Titanium Fitness. Um, it's been a little while since I've vlogged. Just a quick life update for you guys. Training has been sort of spotty. I had like a minor neck injury recently where just a weird sublux, subluxation in my neck um, caused some like nerve pain for a little while. So I just rested on that for uh, a week and a half, two weeks or so. But I'm back at it, got back to training. You guys can see. Olympus looks different. We got our Eleco plates. This whole setup over here, just for powerlifting. So, some of you guys probably know, if you've been following me for a little while, uh, that I've been struggling with uh, my squat being a little asymmetrical, where the bar is kind of tilted on my back, it seems. Uh, it's not just tilted, it's sort of rotated around, around as well. Uh, and I think, I'm fairly certain what's happening is that my like pro perception is a little bit off, where I think when I choose a focus point straight in front of me, it's actually just off to the right a little bit. So my head basically comes this way. My body compensates by like rotating my torso this way, and the bar drops sort of back and down on the left. Um, and my left shoulder ends up when we replace compared to my right. And then from there, like from the bottom down, kind of just messes everything up. So I'm working on it. As you can see, it's not perfect yet, but it's definitely better than it was like a month ago, just by not having a good opportunity to train for a little while. But one more set here, one more set, and then accessories, and then I'm out of here. Come on, Gabriel. How did you do? Watch out, man.
Oh man. I think I'm gonna die. I'm gonna pass out. So if I go forward this way. Do the opposite of me. So this part will come in towards you. There we go. And then you grab the top part here, one hand. You grab the bottom of your legs and match them up. Right, and then you're gonna fold it in half. And then in half one more time. With that. I usually, I know only, I can only do fold one only. I only That's true, your pants are small. I, I only roll it one, one. I only roll it at the end, that's all I know. Hey man, that's totally fine. Whatever works for you. Fill up, still flying at Olympus. So, in case you guys didn't know, last year we had the first straight versus cancer meet here at Olympus. It ran from about March until July, and in that first, however many months that is, we raised $11,000 for the LLS. Uh, I think that's pretty good, but this next time around, we just started, um, or not just started, like a couple months ago, started the campaign again, and we are now, I think nine weeks out from our event. This time around, it's not just powerlifting. We do have powerlifting meet again, uh, basically the same deal as last time, um, but this time we have our own equipment, as you can see over here. Um, we're also gonna be having an Olympic lifting meet um, in conjunction with Hassle Free Barbell, so shout out to Hassle Free and Kevin for helping us out with that. Uh, we also will be having a beer pong tournament, so shout out to Shauna's coworkers for helping us co uh, coordinate that. Uh, we have beer sponsors, we have equipment sponsors, we have multiple vendors coming out to sell products and services. Um, We'll have information as we get closer to the meet, but I just want to say if you guys are interested in competing or just coming out here to, to watch and hang out, uh, it'll be a good time no matter whether you're competing or you're just watching. So please, please, please go click on that link down below in the description. Check out our website, uh, donate if you want to, uh, or if you just want to sign up for the meet or just get some more information about the event, um, check out that link. I wanted to film because I feel like that's what people do, they film themselves shopping and stuff, but I literally ran into Target to grab a bunch of soap. I also got this, a mouse. Um, this is, according to everybody online, the greatest mouse in the world, the MX Master. Um, I got this because you guys can imagine, I actually just finished my appointment, I had to run home, so, now with Tony, um, look, this is basically what it looks like. So Skype is down here, along with emails um, and whatever links we're working with over here. And then on top over here, I don't want to show you too much information, but on this side over here, over here, we've got uh, my client file. So basically we'll put all of his data in on that side. I'll take notes as far as his feedback for the week, as well as just uh, keeping track of how he's doing. Um, I'll make my calculations and my projections on that sheet as well. And then every week we have a new basically block for that week. Uh, and then on the other side, what is going on with the camera? Cool. On the other side over here, on my left, on the top, that is uh, the clients or the athletes tracking log for their training, uh, their nutrition, their weight, their sleep, everything that we're tracking, all that data. Um, so I have, like, I'm glad I have this set up now where I have, you know, the big monitor up there, the laptop down here, and then hopefully the mouse will help me navigate spreadsheets a little faster, be a little more productive. That's the thing, it's not like this mouse was cheap, but um, I feel like if I can ever make an investment into my productivity, make sure that I work more efficiently, then it's worth it. Um, if I work more efficiently, I can work more and I can make more money, if that's important. Um, it is important. And yeah, that's how I feel about things. And in general, I feel like whenever I buy things, I always wanna buy whatever's best because at, if I buy whatever's best, then I feel like I won't have to replace it for you know, some unreasonable amount of time. Whereas if I buy like a cheap one, I might be tempted to replace it like a year from now. You know, so it's my two cents. All you nerds out there, don't make fun of me, but basically what I've got here, there's a book under there for some reason. Um, I've got this uh, desktop stand for my monitor. It's a 24 inch Dell monitor. And then uh, this is my laptop here. HDMI connection for that, charger for that. Cable management is not great, but it's decent. And if you're wondering what my week has looked like so far, basically subtract that and that's what it looks like. I'm actually gonna call it a day for vlogging. Um, I have quite a few things left to do, but I don't wanna, s my phone's going off. I don't wanna spend too much time filming just because I have a lot of work to get done. I have to eat still. Um, 
But I just want to say thank you guys for watching. Um, if you have any suggestions, if you like this kind of video, let me know. I'm kind of interested uh, more recently, not just because I have less time, but just because I feel like it's uh, a different aspect of my life I haven't really shared with you guys too much. But I've been kind of interested in, in kind of starting to daily vlog again, but more so for the sake of showing you guys what it's like for me to run my own business um, as a 21-year-old entrepreneur. <laughs> um, a lot of the stuff, like if you told me a year ago that I'd be where I'm at today, I would not believe it at all. I could not imagine it. I'm very grateful for the opportunity that I have, but at the same time, uh, it's it's been a struggle and it continues to be a struggle for me to find ways to continue expanding, continue growing, making sure that I can make a living doing what I do um, and still have time for the people who are important for me and the things that are important for me. But yeah, I think that that might be an interesting idea. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Love you guys. I'll see you soon. Peace.